might say that I'm a loner But I just call it being free I am my heart's only owner Good morning everyone. I hope everyone is having a great day today. Me and Calvin is going to fix uh, some pancakes this morning for our breakfast. And uh, thanks to Eric and Patrick, uh, they sent us uh, some pancake mix, Dolly Parton, and uh, does an uh, 18 count of eggs through Walmart Plus. And we thank you very much for it, don't we, Calvin? We sure do. And so, uh, we just thought we'd bring you along and show you what we're having for breakfast today. Okay, we're going to be having um, pancakes and uh, eggs, and we've got some good coffee right here that Calvin has already made us. And we're going to be having bacon and eggs, so we just thought we would bring you along and show you what um, we're having this morning for breakfast. Okay, and I've already got the bacon started, so let me get this bacon cooked up and. Uh, the last thing we'll cook is the pancakes. We won't keep them good and hot. This coffee is good today, Calvin. Oh, thank you, Marie. You're drinking that in your favorite cup, aren't you? Uh-huh. We've had that cup a lot of years. Uh -huh. And then the other cup that we're using here, uh, this is one that says, do what you love and love what you do. Yeah, I know. And, I know about that one. Yeah. That's where I got my saying from. And we found that cup at uh, Dollar Tree, didn't we? Yeah, I said, that's exactly my philosophy. Because back then, then I could do all of my uh, hobbies and everything, and I love doing them. But I've gotten a little older now, and I can't do all of them, but I still do what I can. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> and I love doing it. And on that cup there, we have one of our viewers, uh, Lori. She uh, found one of those in the store, uh -huh. and she bought it and sent it to us. I so, know. so we've got two of those now. Okay, the bacon's almost done. Maybe about one more minute. Okay, I think that looks good. I think the bacon's done right there. Good, yeah, it does, don't it? I got one piece that's not quite done. It was there on the end. I'm going to give it just a few more seconds here. And I just tried some of your coffee, Marie. Coffee is very good. Yes, it was very good today. with pancakes and also like it with um, um, biscuits and gravy. Oh yeah. We haven't had sausage and biscuits and gravy in a while, have we? No. <laughs>
Okay, next I'm going to do our scrambled eggs. And we're going to have three eggs today, and we'll split them between us. So that'll be about one and a half piece. Yeah. Usually when I eat pancakes, I don't want nothing but pancakes. And that's it, because that's about all I can eat. <laughs> but <laughs> well, I need some protein, so that'll be good. It'll be good for both of us. And uh, we'll just, I'll make the pancakes be sort of small or medium size. I won't make them real huge. Okay, that oil should be just about hot enough there. When I cook my scrambled eggs, I like to use just a little bit of oil. And a lot of times I'll put bacon grease in there to cook my scrambled eggs. But today I'm just going to use oil. And then I like just a little bit of butter to mix in with the oil. I just like the flavor that it gives the scrambled eggs. And as soon as the eggs are done, the next step we'll do is we'll make the pancakes. Below, I would like for people to um, say what is their favorite pancake mix. Okay. We really like this that we're um, using now. This um, Dolly Parton buttermilk pancakes. Mm -hmm. We had some yesterday, and we really loved them. That's why we're having them again. Yes, they they were delicious yesterday, mm -hmm. and that's the first time we've ever had these before. Uh -huh. I believe I said in the, the descriptions below, but I meant in the comments. <laughs> Okay, Marie, if you want to go ahead and mix up the pancake batter, uh, mm -hmm. I'll cook them just as soon as this uh, eggs gets through. All right. Okay, so I'm going to be putting in this um, cup of the pancake mix, three-fourths cups of water. Okay, now give it a good stir. I might should have used one of my uh, rubber spoons so I wouldn't make so much noise. You got ready? Yes. Okay, we can go ahead and start making our plates up then. Okay. I see, I see through that cup though I didn't get a little bit right here.
and same for like you know what she's doing. <laughs> I love my kids scrambled eggs. <laughs> I don't think I've ever made them on camera. Um, I don't like eggs when they're real. Um, what's the word for it? Crispy. Yeah, crispy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need them, right? Okay, let's get our plates ready. I don't know who taught you to make eggs. <laughs> I guess you did, Marie. <laughs> no, I don't think I did. I think you are. I think you might have taught me how to do them. <laughs> no, I've always cooked uh, fluffy eggs. Um, my trick is now some people put milk in their eggs. Mm -hmm. But I put water in my eggs, and I put about a quarter of a cup of water in the bowl, mm -hmm. and then I mixed up three eggs. Yeah, well, I do it both ways. It just, that's the kind of cook I am, just whatever mood I'm in, and I think it'll work and it'll be good. That's what I do. <laughs> okay, eggs are done. And I do follow uh, recipes quite uh, to the exact almost the exact thing i do change it around some okay there's eggs and let this oil get just a little bit warmer and then i'll start the pancakes okay and i'm gonna try to make them smile marie so they won't be too terribly big for us all right so we need a spoon I'll just cook two at a time, mm -hmm. and then uh, I'll cook the other two, and we'll have two apiece. Okay. When I was growing up, my grand not my grandmother, but my mother, she made big pancakes. Yeah. <laughs> you about one is all you could eat. <laughs> yeah, we have made them where they cover the whole pan, haven't we? Yeah. Okay, Marie, there's the bacon, and I only want two slices of bacon. Okay. to talk about this coffee so much but this is very good coffee today our phone usually always beeps by the time we get started cooking that right yeah. so you enjoy that coffee Marie? I, I do but I better just stick with one and not drink two this is our favorite coffee we uh, drink the uh, We like the Folgers uh, decaffeinated coffee, and then we put a little bit of uh, hazelnut creamer in it, mm -hmm. and just a little bit of artificial sweetener. Yep. When I was younger, I used to drink it black. That was healthier. <laughs> a lot of people like black coffee, but I, I just never it. have liked it. I don't know why, but I changed and I just don't like it now. I like your new shirt you're wearing today, Marie. Thank you. It was um, on clearance uh -huh. at uh, Walmart yesterday. It was. It cost me all together three dollars. <laughs> oh my goodness! You got that shirt for three dollars? I did. You did great. Yeah, I, I'm not a big spender on clothes, money on clothes. And if I can get a deal, I'll try it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did good. We have to get on camera so much, and I have to wear so many different blouses. Mm -hmm. If I can get them reasonable, that's what I do. <laughs> now, a lot of people comment about your headbands. Mm -hmm. Is that one that you got at Dollar Tree also? Yeah, I didn't get this at the Dollar Tree, but I got that at the headband. Yeah, at the yes. Okay. But if they had some for three dollars or one dollar at the Dollar Tree, I wouldn't 
I wouldn't pass it down. <laughs> But if I'm going somewhere, you know, nice and stuff like that, this is just wearing around the house stuff. Yeah. We have one of those big electric griddles uh -huh. out in our pantry, and we could have got that out and cooked them all at one time. We could have. But this here works just fine. We don't want to clean it up, do we? <laughs> breakfast. <laughs> I am starting to get hungry and uh, I'll let you put the butter and syrup on them if you don't mind, all right? Okay. Right, let's finish that last one. We'll get one more sip of this coffee. It is good. I wish that I could um, drink the good stuff instead of the decaf. <laughs> But if I did, I would be running around the house and counting booths trying to get me to sit down. <laughs> Probably so. I'd be wired up, that's for sure. Okay. Okay, I think that's done, Marie. That's the first one. And what I'll do, I'll give you one. And I'll give me one, and you can go ahead and put butter and syrup on them while I cook the next one at the top. I know butter's not good for my cholesterol, and a lot of things are not, but you got to have some butter and some pancakes. <laughs> Okay, next two will be ready here in just a minute. I like to get some sugar-free syrup when we can, but they don't they didn't have it. They don't always have it. Uh-uh. I'm gonna put, put a little more black pepper on mine. You can put some more black pepper on mine too, Marie. Okay. A big old watermelon in my refrigerator and uh, I don't have any cantaloupe. The last two cantaloupes I got were not sweet so I'm going to try this watermelon probably tomorrow. Hopefully it'll be a good watermelon. Yeah. I'm pretty good at picking them out but uh, on the cantaloupe I must not be that great on it. <laughs> Well, now you got to remember though, both of those cantaloupes that wasn't ripe, we got them on grocery pickup. Yeah. That's right. But even if you went inside, it'd probably it'd be like all the bananas. Bananas are always green when you get them at Walmart. Yeah. And it's hard to get a good banana. Yeah. Yeah, we could have used our griddle and saved us a lot of time. Yeah. Okay, I think these are about ready to flip. Just another second or two here. Now these are going to be on top, so I don't want to burn them, do I? <laughs> but I think they're looking good. Okay, we'll go ahead and flip them. Okay, yeah, that one looks good, Marie. That one looks good. You never know what they're going to look like on the bottom until you flip them over, do you? No. There's nothing worse than getting a pancake that's not cooked all the way through. Yeah, I'm not sure it's cooked all and the way through. And also a hamburger. But now some people like their hamburgers medium rare. 
-hmm. or even rib, but not me. I like my meat to be cooked. <laughs> Okay, Marie, I think these are done. Yeah, they look good. I'm going to put that in over here. That is a small one. I'm giving it to me. I'll give you the one that's just a little bit bigger. If I can get it to come off. There we go. I think we're ready to eat to do the taste test. Sounds good to me, Marie. I think all we need to do is just taste the pancakes. pancakes. <laughs> well, we had one yesterday, so we already know they were good yesterday, weren't they? Yeah. Mmm. Very good again today, too. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. And of course, we know we're going to love bacon. <clears throat> we know we're going to love bacon and eggs. Mm -hmm. We make that all the time. Okay. We really like y'all coming along with us and um, seeing what we're having for breakfast today. Mm -hmm. And um, so I guess we'll close our video out now unless Kevin has something else he wants to say. Um, yeah, I got one more thing I want to say, Marie. Okay. I want to get over there and start eating. <laughs> I'm ready for this. <laughs> so y'all have a great day. Uh, this is Monday morning. I don't know if we talked about that earlier, but it's a Monday morning early, and we're going to try to get this edited and put it out for you today, Monday afternoon. So I hope you enjoy it. Leave us some comments and let us know what you think about it. And if you've ever tried the Dolly Parton pancakes, let us know because we really enjoy them. They're good, aren't they, Marie? Right. Okay, Marie, you can close her out. Okay, so y'all have a great day today. And do what you love and love what you do. And we'll see you on the next video. Bye. Take me back, take me back to the old dirt road Where mama and papa used to go Let's sing all them songs from a long time